Hello dear viewers, this is Dr. Muhammad Aminul Islam. Welcome to Aminul Cam Innovation. In my previous videos, I explained how to get a scholarship and how to apply for PhD and Master's scholarship. In this video, I would like to explain how to find MS or PhD supervisor easily. This video is very important, so please do not skip. Well, before you apply for graduate research candidature, such as master's or PhD, you must identify a potential supervisor and receive in principle ap approval for your research project. You will need to include your potential supervisor's detail on your application form. Without supervisor, you cannot apply for admission and scholarship. So it is mandatory to most of the universities of the world. Now, how to find a supervisor? Well, finding supervisor is a challenging. However, if you follow certain strategy, you can easily find supervisor to apply for admission and scholarship. So some strategies are university website, research field, network, advertisement, social media. Now let us explain. University website. University website is the most authentic way to find your desired supervisor. So browse the faculty pages of relevant departments looking for researchers whose work align with your interest. Visit the university website, find your interest department or research group, and then find people, lecturer to professor, scientist, research fellow, or even postdoc. Send an email to all of them separately. Never do BCC or CCC. It is important to note that you can also send email to a postdoc because supervisors are very busy people. They don't have time to check email and reply email. So if you send email to postdoc and if if postdoc feels that your CV is good, everything is good, then he can recommend you to the professor. So university website is the most prominent way to find potential supervisor and their email address. For example, I search list of chemistry university in Australia. So these are the uh, university where chemistry, uh, MS and PhD programs involve. So for example, if you click on Monas, then uh, go to chemistry department, then you will find faculty or research staff, then visit there and find your research interest people. After finding, then send them email instantly if your email format is ready. So similarly, you can visit other universities and send them email as much as possible. Because the more you send email, the possibility of getting supervisor increases radically. So it is better to send more email and more university. Then comes research field or publication. So explore recent publications, conference proceedings, and online database like Google Scholar or ResearchGate to find academics actively researching in your area. For example, if you find a paper, then corresponding author's email address is given on that paper. So 
then you can easily send email to the corresponding author. Similarly, conference abstract or proceeding, they are also mentioned uh, email address and you can take it and send email. Then online database also uh, help you, for example, Google Scholar and ResearchGate. Then you can find their email address and send email. Then comes network. Often networking helps you to find MS or PhD supervisor. For example, talk to a professor at your current or previous university or attend academic conferences to connect with the researcher. Also, talk to uh, your senior brothers at your current or previous university about finding a probable supervisor. An important thing is contact the known person already studying at your desired universities. Because those who are doing MS or PhD in your desired university, they know who will take future students. Then, uh, you can collect email address from them and approach them for your MS or PhD supervisors. So networking helps much. Then come advertisement. Consider advertised project. Some universities advertise a specific PhD project or scholarships where supervisor email address is given or supervisor Page is given so that you can easily uh, collect email address and send them email. So advertisements are published in various newspapers or other social medias. So from advertisement you can also collect uh, email address and thus send them email to manage your supervisor. Social media. Social media can be helpful for finding potential supervisor for your master's or PhD supervision. For example, Facebook, LinkedIn, X or YouTube. So browsing this uh, social media, you can easily collect supervisor and apply for admission and scholarship. The most important thing is you have to stick to finding supervisor because finding supervisor means to get admission and scholarship. The last thing is after getting supervisor then you need to apply for admission. If you meet admission requirement then they will send you admission offer letter if you accept your offer letter not necessary to get admission then they will send your application for a scholarship and if you are, are eligible for a scholarship then you will be informed by email that's for today if you have any query please leave your comment in the comment box Please do visit Aminul Camp Innovation for other important videos. Thanks for watching.